Uh, when you think of an internationally recognised Kiwi sports team, who do you think of? The All Blacks, the Black Caps? Well, how about the New Zealand Junior Paddle Ferns? Our under-21 national canoe polo team, who just took the gold in the canoe polo world championships in France. Take a look. It's looking relatively level pegging at this point. Oh, that was a hard knock there. School of hard knocks. Oh, that's nice. Oh, wow. That's nice. That's what we expect from New Zealand. Hayley Cameron inside. Where to go? They're all in that huddle. This is incredible. I've never seen anything quite like that. There's two sets of pens just floating on the pitch. That was a wrap. Scrabbling to get their paddles. No snow defence. No. Wow! That is amazing. They've done it! Some of the most incredible pressure on their goal line. Excited this morning to have here in the studio Junior Paddle Ferns New Zealand captain Kate Blinko and Junior Paddle Ferns New Zealand player Hayley Cameron. Good morning. Good morning. Yeah. Congratulations. Thank you. Yeah, big deal getting gold. It it's is. Awesome. How does it feel? Honestly, it's unbelievable. It hasn't really sunk in yet. Um, yeah, we've been back for two weeks now. And we're still just, yeah, on a high. Tell us how significant this is, because you knocked out Germany, right? Mm -hmm. How successful has Germany been at this competition? Pretty successful. I think um, the commentator called them the European powerhouse, so pretty insane to take them down. But um, as you can see probably on the trophy, Germany's won so many times, I think five out of seven times. Yeah. It's been um, contested, and they were going for their fifth straight, fourth straight title. So you guys have done incredibly well to knock them off the perch. What, were, what was the reaction from people um, in France when you won? I think in pool play we, we did dominate a little bit, so we went undefeated in the tournament. Um, and I think, yeah, I think people were pretty, not surprised, um, with little old New Zealand coming, coming in hot, but <laughs> we did, yeah, we did show them how it was done, I think. How did you get into this? Because it is a little unusual, the sport, right? Yeah, <laughs> for sure. Um, I think we both started at high school, right? Yeah. But, um, yeah, New Zealand's pretty good with our programs. We've got heaps of up-and-coming programs for the school kids and right up to vets and masters. So, yeah, pretty much we got in at school age, but there's plenty of people that get in as an adult. I want to know about the rules, because um, we're just looking at some of the footage now. So you, you must have incredible um, strength to be able to manoeuvre these things. It's like bumper boats watching yeah. over here. Like, is it dangerous? Do you get hurt? Yeah, we, we do get hurt. You get hit with paddles quite a lot. You come home from a tournament with a lot of bruises. <laughs> um, there is a rule, like when you're holding the ball, a paddle can't be within a metre of the ball. So... There, yeah, there are rules in place to try and minimise contact between, like, paddle and people. So the idea is to try and grab the ball and then get the ball into the hoop? Yes. The goal. Oh, the yep. goal, sorry. <laughs> <laughs> Technical term. And I see that people are throwing their paddles at the goal. Is that allowed? Not to throw them, but you do, you kind of slide your hand along your paddle and ah. put your try and get your blade to the ball to stop it, yeah. Like a defensive tactic. Yes. Is it up there? Yeah. yeah. It's very, very cool. Um, so, it, all in all, the um, juniors obviously doing very well, but the senior women as well. Tell us about them. Yes. Yeah, so our senior women attended the World Games, same with our senior men, and the women came away with a bronze medal, which is the first time that a New Zealand team has ever medaled at the World Games, so that was very awesome, very successful year for ladies polo in New Zealand. Yeah, absolutely. Do you feel like you're part of a sport that's growing? Do you feel like a part of a sport that's going to be one of the, a future sport? Yeah, absolutely. I think it's growing by the day, pretty much. We have lots of new clubs. We've got 14 clubs around the country now. Um, five regions that play at, like, a high level. And then we have lots of other kind of informal people playing as well. And, yeah, it's definitely growing and growing. Now that you've won goals at the World Champs, uh, where do you go from here? I mean, what is your next goal? Where do you want to take it individually um, as a, a sporting goal for you, yourself? 
I mean, we both went to Worlds in 2018 and we came with a bronze, so that was awesome. And we obviously had some unfinished business here and we yep. got the gold in the under-21 age group. But I think quite a few of our team were moving up to the senior age group. So I guess another repeat of the 2016 win of gold for our senior women, hopefully one day in the future. And is it? An, it's not an Olympic sport, is it? No. no. And it's, is it a Commonwealth Games sport? No. no. So I guess that's the next pinnacle, isn't <laughs> yeah. it? You need to get it yeah. on the list yes. so you can go and win us some gold medals. We're trying. <laughs> <laughs> Are you trying? Are you, is, is there attempts being made? Yeah, there's like Instagram pages and Facebook pages kind of vouching for canoe polo to be put into the Olympics, so get why behind it. it. <laughs> why do you think it should be? What's your pitch? I mean, like, there's already Olympic-sized swimming pools. That's what our women played in Alabama for the World Games. We don't need any purpose-built venues. All we need are some goals and some refs, and we'll be fine. We're going <laughs> to take it off. Low maintenance. Yeah, yeah. low maintenance. Cheap, reliable, and good fun. Very. Exactly. <laughs> Fantastic. Guys, congratulations on this. This is a huge achievement. And my goodness, the most impressive trophy I think we've ever had in our studio. Beautiful. Hey, thanks yeah. also for bringing um, the canoe in. No, it's no worries. Very yeah, nice cool to have it in. We love a prop. <laughs> Thank you, guys. Junior Paddle Ferns New Zealand captain Kate Blinko and Junior Paddle Ferns New Zealand player Hayley Cameron with us this morning.